Despite the many challenges faced in securing the diplomatic passport, the Pan-African Parliament President maintains that the African Parliament will redouble its efforts to ensure that the dream of issuing each and every parliamentarian with a diplomatic passport is realized. It was with that in mind that Amadi took up the diplomatic passport-related matter with the leadership of the African Union Commission as well as the relevant members of the policy organs. According to him, the response from the AU Commission responsible for the issuing of the passports was positive as the whole project was in principle approved and that the provision could be made in the operational budget of PAP to cover for the cost of its production. Making his contribution on the same issue was the Namibia's head of mission to the Pan-African Parliament, Professor Peter Kashavivi, who supported the diplomatic passport idea, saying that it will make it easier for African parliamentarians to conduct their activities worldwide. The time has come for us to translate these dreams into realities so that the citizens of, of, of Africa can begin to see the benefit of working together across national boundaries. Launched in May in 2007 by the then chairman of the African Union, the late Ghanaian President John Kufur, the African Union diplomatic passport is so far only issued to the 53 heads of state, officials of the AU Secretariat, eminent personalities from the continent and the diaspora.